Alright, let's check this out together. You guys excited? I'm excited. The music on this title screen gets me excited. You ready? Let's 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 fire this bad boy up. Um Where is Welcome to the other side. Now everybody's checking clams. There we go. You guys ready for other side? And uh, once again, thanks to Light Bulb Crew and Focus Home for sending me a copy of the game. Rock out. Horns up. There we go. A kind gesture. Game design and animation pack for Ruha Hu. Thank you so much. Thanks, Ruha Hu. Thank you, gang, for hitting up my humble link today. And of course, five newer gifted subs throughout the stream today. We'll do game ball giveaways. All right, Gizmo Juggler, thanks for following. The otter really is framed perfectly in the circle. See, now I missed it. I didn't, I missed it. New game. <laughs> Marauder. <laughs> yes. From beyond, behind the veil they grow, those you should always beware. In muted darkness they flow, those who feed on your nightmare. And then we got that, we, we got that in closed captioning too. We got that in, uh... Oh, we're doing it again. For centuries, the mother has protected the veil, protecting it from shattering. Her journey has led to the deserted streets of the city, rotted by <laughs> the plague, where a greater threat awaits. Also, hello. Also have to go back to lurk mode because work has me running to many circles and too busy. <laughs> Thank you, Ruaihu. Oh god, what the hell was that? He needs us. The other has come for the chosen one, and soon the veil will break. Okay. Uh-oh. The suffering cannot continue. <laughs> Uh-oh. That eye in the darkness, I know, right? What did you get me into, Sparkwood? Thank you again, Ruaihu. I appreciate it. Thanks for the tip. High tip of the day. Hold to the Nana. The Age of Shattering, 1897. Suffering festers within him. The edge of reality frays. Each battle takes more and more out of me. The other could shred the veil and devour our world. Will you stay with me until the end? I'll give what I can, what I have left. Let it go here and no further. Let it go! Let oh, sorry. Oh, what is this? This looks complicated. Oh, what's going on? Uh -oh. Watch, my friend. Once I move to strike, the first will fall. Health points. These are health points. HP. Your unit dies if their HP reaches zero. All right. So far, I'm, so far, I'm keeping up with the instructions. Action points, AP. These are action points. Most actions cost AP. I'm still, I'm still up. I'm still okay. Move to the red square. The farther you move, the more action points are required. Okay, I can move to the red square. Minus 10 AP. Let's go. The other sends more against us. I can zoom in. That's good. 
Okay, cool. I'm zoomed in. Good morning, Skulldrog. Select the action skill. All right. Instant action skills are played immediately and cost you action points. All right. So slash on this guy. He's a plague doctor. He does 765 damage. Wow. Wow. Everything is like really, really bloated in terms of uh, numbers. Look, 4,900 hit points, 765. Okay. There we go. Strike him. Oh, oh, okay. I did 765 damage to him. Remnant is up for free. Go, go, go get Remnant from the Ashes for free on the Epic Game Store. Gang, that game was one of my top games from last year. It's so good. Azari and I were playing it uh, in the evening together. You can play with up to three people. It's fun. It's fun. New DLC soon. All right. So the timeline orders all units by their initiative and moves forward whenever a unit ends their turn. A unit can play. A unit can play when it reaches zero on the left side of the timeline. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. That was a little bit weirded. A little word. That was weirded a little oddly. This was, that was worded a little oddly. Jeez. No one clipped that. Okay. That was weirded a little wordy, odd lid. What? End your turn. The unit will move to 50 on the timeline and recover their uh, AP for the next turn. Okay. Backspace to end turn. Who's this wiggler? Delayed action, massive shot. This character's name is Mother, huh? Okay. Delayed skills immediately end the unit's turn, and their powerful effects are delayed later on the timeline. Okay, so he delayed his attack. He's gonna shoot over here. It's gonna be bad. Wordly words won't wool my tongue. There you go. The cult is prepared, so we gotta get rid of him. Select shield charge. This skill will delay the target's next action. It will also cancel their delayed attack. Okay. Shield charge. Okay. So I interrupted their delayed attack. Okay. Gotcha. Interrupt skills can stop a single enemy attack and immediately launch a counterattack. Warning. Interrupt skills cost health points they do select vengeful stance it will interrupt the next melee attack and launch a devastating counterattack all right it costs 20 hit points here your unit will move to 50 on the timeline okay ready. Now we got this butt wipe up here. Nice sickle. Alright, hopefully they teach me an AoE now. I need an AoE. Fear not. I can stop the attack before it happens. Good. Spear tornado. Yes. Yes, please. Target your active unit. Well, that was pretty sick. So many streamers. This is a cursed therapist, is the name of this creature. Cursed therapist, I like it. Plague doctors. 
All right, your unit will go into burst if they start using their last 50 AP. This pushes your unit back to 100 on the timeline, so be careful to burst only when you need an extra move or to deal a killing blow to a wounded enemy. Okay. So if you use more than 50 AP in a turn, some skills like shield charge can delay the next time an enemy will play to give you more control on the timeline. You just really sell for 37 months, man. Dad, you're a man beast, baby, yeah. Valoroka! Thank you so much for the resub. Hype and love in the chat for Valoroka. And Issa Yuff, thanks for following. All right, so some skills like shield charge can delay the time an enemy will play to give you more control of the timeline. Okay. So, my, all right, dodge is the percentage chance a unit has of avoiding an attack. Okay, that's this 0%. Thank you. Armor is a unit's protection. It represents the damage deducted from each attack. Okay, armor and dodge can be modified by ally and enemy skills. Okay. And remember, the timeline is the key to winning battles. Powerful delayed skills end your turn's unit. Your unit's turn immediately and activate later. Interrupt skills prepare your unit to block it an attack and strike back after their turn. Some skills delay the time an enemy will play to give you more control and using your last 50 AP will provoke a burst. All right, this is just a summary of everything Gift we just gives learned. Me such strength. All right, can I just lower the music volume? I can. That way I can think a little bit more. All right. See what we got here. All right, so let's take this guy out with a slash, maybe. Um, shield charge. Okay, so I, I used my burst. I don't know if that was good. Oh, I didn't know there was another guy. Uh-oh. Is he summoning more hands? Ah, you missed! I dodged him! You're digging the soundtrack? Yeah, it's pretty cool, Valoroga. I just hope they have more songs than just one. All right, should I try the spear tornado again? Now let's just kill this guy. Um, I'm gonna use the vengeful stance. It's an interruption. All right, see what happens. Oh man. In my turn. Here comes the massive shot. Okay, good. I was wondering that would happen. I got scratched, guys. That's not good. I got scratched again. He's gonna summon more things. The hell is that? Needle nose Ned and a plague guard. Where are all these people coming from? Can I shield charge? Where's the? Oh, here he is. No, I cannot. Let's move. I wonder if there's the tax of opportunity. All right, so he can't do the shot he was gonna do. And, end turn. All 
I have a feeling like after this tutorial, we're gonna have like really low level characters. We're gonna have people with not so, not quite as many options and moves. Plague Butcher. Parthenad, thanks for following. I hope I said your name right. I wonder if my I wonder if my AoE can hit everybody. All right, let's see. My AoE is the Spear Tornado. It would get almost everybody. And it's going to put me in the burst zone, though. Yeah, let's try it. Oh, wow. This one survived. They're summoning more and more stuff. How do I get that to stop? That's so bad. Hi, Leo Wild. What's up? He is here. The chosen one. Oh, it's the child. He has 10,000 hit points. All right. I don't want to harm you, little one. I do. But we want to harm you very much. Okay, that's a little creepy. That's a little creepy. I have failed. You most I of found all. These. You can have them. I fought with every bone and sinew. All I am, I leave to you. Take it. My blood is my legacy. May it spill forth into an army to rend suffering from its host. Okay. All right. That was very creepy. Twilight, thank you so much for the bits. The city was destroyed. The veil fractured. Thousands of souls perished. Swallowed by the void. All right. You were a close tester for this adverse? Nice. My voice destroyed a city. It's not enough. How soon will you hatch? I want you in this world. No. I want to see what you can do to those that hurt me. To those you will hurt. I can't wait. I want to see what you can do. To the world, hurt the world. <laughs> Kick his butt. Time and space converged. I don't get to read the rest of that because I was mocking the bad guy. Do not despair. My life lights your path. Hey, Nolan. Do you remember our journey together? This time, let me guide you. You will wield my memories like a sword, and with them, grow our army. Ooh. Do we get lots of characters? I want lots of characters. And thus, we, uh, thus we're trapped in an everlasting loop from recollection to recollection. Daughters of the Red Mother die, only to rise again. I guess we are going to be the Daughters of the Red Mother. The Age of Shattering, 1897 and 1929. Okay. This dark corner of existence is a harbinger. Soon all will follow. The very fabric of our reality is threatened. My last breath is near. My daughters, you are of me. Put an end to suffering. We gotta stop that thing from hatching. That's pretty much it. Other Side is a game about sacrifice, sacrifice and tough choices. Progress is auto-saved, so there's no turning back. 
The enemies on the other side are lethal, and every mistake will cost you dearly. Your daughters will die, and you will lose, only to rise again stronger. Ah, oh, roguelike. Oh. Oh, I didn't even know that. The game expects players to fail, but failure is not the end. After ending a run, you restart with additional bonuses and even the ability to resurrect fallen daughters for a cost. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, roguelike XCOM. Yeah, okay. All right. You can't hide from me. From this side of the veil, I can give you my daughters, birthed from my soul. You will need them to fight. This is the chrono map from what here. What will you remember now? This is the chrono map. From here, you will be able to manage your daughters in the inner void, select your mission from the attack menu, and end the day. Let's enter the inner void to germinate a new daughter. Okay. Enter the inner void. Welcome to the inner void. End the day sounds good. <laughs> I know it's end the day. All right, welcome to the inner void. Here you can manage your daughters. All right. First thing we have to do is get rid of the name Clements. <laughs> enter, the, enter the birthing pool. <laughs> I don't wanna. <laughs> Here you can manage your daughters. All right. Um. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> it's moist. Don't say that. Germinate a daughter. Creating a new daughter costs 200 vite. 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 How do you say that word? Vite. 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 Vitamin. Alright, let's do it. Space. Vite. Alright. Okay, so Felicity, do random or rename? Do you get other choices? I guess not, not here. All right, first word that you put in chat, first person, one word. Five months in a row? Shut the front door. Yo, yo, yo. Really, you, named, you put the word word in? Word? I'm going to skip word and go for boo. <laughs> Rose Wolf got boo. <laughs> Scruffy Nerve Herder, thank you so much for the five-month resub. Yo, yo, yo. What's up? How you doing? <laughs> Twilight's all offended. <laughs> you did follow the directions. That's true. <laughs> boo. There we go. The Blade Master excels in melee duels. The Soul Slinger supports her sisters from afar. The Shield Bearer protects her sisters. Assign a class to your daughter. Choose wisely as it cannot be changed later. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> um, what one do you think, gang? You guys have a preference? Blade Master, Soul Singer, Shield Bearer. Adris, if I get stuck with something, I'll ask. I just want to kind of explore it on my own. Blade Master sounds cool. Should we start with like the DPS? Agile sword fighter. Oh, this one's ranged with guns. Okay. It's the one Azaria would play. Shield bearer. Has more defense than her sisters. And is capable of controlling most enemies with her shield. Oh. Alright, let's start with the tank. Boo the tank. 
Let's do it. The others are converging, warping reality. You must stop suffering from feeding. Go. Close the first synapse. Do I have to? Attack available synapses. Okay, it's a hunt, it's challenging. One to three daughters. 150 of these things for a reward, 25 of these things, and 100 experience points. New missions or synapses appear each day. Beat a synapse to close it. Select the synapse. I select this one. You need a little familiar named Minsk now. Yes! Go for the eyes, boo! Here you can view mission details and choose the daughters you want to send. Select a daughter. So they give me three. Oh, okay. Boo. Can I just pick more? Is there any reason not to pick all of them? Info. Uh. Adverse. You've played before. Should I pick all of these? Should I put them all in? I don't want I don't want the names Clements though and Prudence. Can I go back and change my peoples? No, I think we're Oh no, okay, we can. Hold on. Where are my peoples? Attack inner void. Oh man, they won't let me do it because I'm stuck in tutorial mode. All right, never mind. Okay, we got Boo, Clements, and Prudence. Start mission. Zing. Take away his tools of torture. The physical laws of reality have no bearing on the others. Flanking behavior. When a unit is engaged in melee combat, attacks coming from the flank or the back will hurt more. How many have died to appease suffering's ambition? How many more? All right. Here we go. Hunt all the creatures. Four enemies remaining. All right, it's Prudence's turn. Prudence has move, a shot, intercepting round. Interrupt the first attack on an ally within 10 range. Okay. Takes 10% of their hit points to do that. And look, our, our hit points are much lower than before. Shot takes 25 AP. I got moved too far. Clements. I like how they just go. They just skate across the battlefield. Flanking beans. Otter side. Yeah, I wish it was called Otter side. Oh, I didn't even know you were there. Man, they're kind of creepy when they move. Alright, Prudence. Shot. Right, and intercepting round. And turn. Lemons. 
deal up to 834 damage after 30 initiative units ends your turn. Or I could just slash this guy. What does the slash do? 674. It's not gonna, quite gonna kill him. Uh, it's okay. There we go. Smack the crap out of him and turn. Lunge. Lunge or slam. Let's do slam, I guess. Dead. I revel in her strength. Yes. All right, and turn. Let's see if this shot happens. Let's see if this interrupting shot does anything. No. They didn't do anything. Let's just kill this guy. No mercy. You can zoom in and out. Electric Messiah. Yeah. The doctor has sent. Like all the way out here. I don't think I can spin it. Doesn't seem to be able to rotate the camera, but you can zoom in and out. Yeah. Yeah. Place your says, what's this about? We're finding out. We're this is still the tutorial. Yeah, it's like a roguelite. So you're expecting your characters to die and your run to end and you start over. Uh turn based. Can I shoot again? I should probably shoot again. Even if it Even if it puts me at the back of the initiative. Clements. Um, I'm going to wait for them to come to me. Come to me. Oh, come on. Massive shot. Stop progress. The cure will be found. Yes. One enemy remains. The witch unlocked. Memories of another life. Guard Guardian unlocked. Well. Are these other classes I'm getting? You're not sure how much the tactical part of the timeline is going to be used here. Quite interesting mechanic, though. You mean with me? I feel like you're making fun of me. They worship torture and call it science. What do you mean, Golemancy? What have I what have I done that you find suspicious? I just started, I'm learning the game. I'm being judged, gang. Did you see this? Impressive. See, there was no need for me to save up there, yeah. My dreams are filled with infinite shadows entangled. My brave oh. daughter is spent. She must rest till a new day. What? What do you mean spent? Enemies killed four, gathered vitae, 150. Memories recovered two. All right, why do I have to rest? Come what may, we will slow suffering's progress. Level up. Nice. First victory. A recollection ends if you have no way to continue. If you get beaten by a boss or if you choose to end it yourself. This will let you start a new try on the first day. And gives you access to more crystal shards resources that you gain from missions and can be used to buy remembrances power-ups I don't know if I fully understand all that a recollection ends if you have no way to continue if you get beaten by a boss or if you choose to end it yourself all right select next day you can only move to the next day after closing at least one synapse okay daughters need to rest they cannot fight more than once per day ah okay 
next day. Rest and prepare. Okay. All right. Golem, I said, don't be mean. He hasn't even killed a horse yet. I'm watching you, Brew Brew. One of your daughters can learn a new skill. In the inner void. All right, boo. Here you can see your daughter's stats, traits, and skills. Skills can be unlocked by reaching new levels of mastery and upgraded with memories. Each time you unlock a new skill, you have to choose between two different abilities. New skill available. Blacksmith's Grace, a reaction for self, increases armor by 180 for 40 and move up to 15 initiative units on the timeline for each incoming attack. Okay, it takes 5% of your hit points to do that. But will, but will said skills pay the bills? Probably not, no. Memories at the corner of my eyes. Uh, or we can do shield bash. Deal up to 248 damage, push to target five tiles. Enemies pushed each other. Uh, I'm gonna do shield bash. Chill bash. Hell yeah. This daughter has earned a new trait, reflecting on what she has experienced. Traits cannot be removed or changed, even in death. Traits. Sacrifice or regenerate. Where do I choose the traits? They said I would do two traits. Place memory. Equipped memory? Oh, which? Increase the critical chance of a skill by 5%. Or guardian. Memory incompatible. Increase damage done by... Oh, okay. So that's not a new class. They're like modifiers for your skills. Oh. Oh, there's a cemetery too to track the people you've died. Okay, I got it. You missed, the ref uh, you missed it, but final review of Ghost of Tsushima. I talked about it at the end of the stream yesterday, Witty. Uh, incredible game overall. If you like over o uh, open world samurai games, or if you want to be a samurai and you like open world games, Ghost of Tsushima is one of the best ever. Probably the best ever. Yeah. Okay, so available memories. Uh, let's, let's look at Clemens here. New skill. Lightning Strike. Dash five tiles to deal up the 390 damage. Immovable stance. React to an enemy finishing movement in melee range and deal up to 520 damage. Takes 5% hit points. <sighs> That's really weird. I kind of want a lightning strike. Yeah, I beat it. I beat it. Not already. It took me 11 streams. Yeah. 11 streams. So, it's a lot. <laughs> All right, and then Prudence gets a new skill. Deal up to 229 to an enemy in range taking damage from an al okay, from an ally. Or deal up to 329 AoE. See, I, I want all the ones that don't take up hit points. It's probably, probably a mistake to do that. But that's what I'm thinking right now. Can you rename them? That's the question. I don't know how to rename them. Remember their courage. Each time a daughter dies, she ends up in the cemetery. You can resurrect the daughter using a resurrection token. Any memories the daughter has equipped are lost on death. Resurrection tokens are rewarded when successfully completing rescue missions or when unlocking certain remembrances. Those hit point ones used to be fixed numbers, if you recall correctly. Probably got abused. Remember. Remembrance gives you access to bonuses that last through the whole recollection. 
A remembrance remains unlocked once it is locked. A remembrance remains unlocked once it's unlocked. Even if you start a new recollection. Unlocking a remembrance doesn't activate it automatically. You must use shards to activate it. You earn shards every time you complete a mission, but your pool of shards is limited to those you had at the start of the recollection. Once you start a new recollection, you gain access. See, when they change the words of things, it gets so it's so confusing. Like if they change like the word quest to recollection, then I have no idea what they're talking about. So what is a recollection or a remembrance? What, is, what does that mean? Remembrance is a bonus, right? Okay. What's a recollection? <laughs> How funny. Damage to left eyeball? Recollections are missions? A campaign? Okay. What is this? Damaged left eyeball torn from its socket. This eyeball stares infinitely into nothingness, surrounding the pupil <laughs> in a golden halo that oozes blood from its myriad of gashes. Remembrance is permanent. Bonuses buffs for your daughters, I guess. Through all playthroughs. Okay. Recollections are each time cycle. All right. And we've got a damaged left eyeball that we can activate. I just started it. I don't even know what that does. All right, here's our codex. Mother lived for hundreds of years. Playing doctors. All right, so there's a compendium there. Remember. Remember. Must remember who you are, Simba. Give life to our daughters. All right, let's go back. Memories recovered. Memories are obtained when killing certain enemies. They are upgrades you can assign to your daughter's skills, adding various effects. Anything from increasing damage or defense to impacting the timeline. Additionally, every memory unlocks a new part of the codex in the memory section. One of your daughters can learn a new skill in the inner void. All right. I'm assuming they're meaning. Putting in a memory. Shield bash. Increases the damage of a skill by 50. This costs 100 things, though. Increase the damage of all skills. By 20%. Sure. Put that in there. Slam. Remember, if this character dies, then we lose it. Alright, let's go with just that. Memories are obtained when killing certain enemies. Yeah, we saw that. Alright, here we go. X recollection, 25 shards. Okay. Let's bring our three characters. This game vomited a lot of stuff at you very quickly. It did. I agree with that. At least they taught you stuff, but I feel like I didn't have enough context to understand a lot of it. So we're just gonna go. How many characters do you control right now? Three. Yeah. Farewell, daughters. Bru, bru, I, yeah, I don't know. I don't know everything that I just experienced. <laughs> I don't. I, I didn't grasp everything, but we'll learn what it together. What they did to this child? What forces they arrayed against an innocent? All right, create your own combos. They really cheesed your hunger away. You now have access to more skills, allowing you to combine direct actions, interrupts, and reactions. Nine enemies remaining. Look at these plague doctors, like, in the audience, I guess. Whatever they're called. Cursed therapists. 
We've got scavengers. All the way over here, we have plague doctors. All right. Who gets to go first? Prudence. Can I go across that or no? If I take the shot. I think they have to go around. Okay, move her up. And the shield bearer. Alright, here we go. Games sometimes try to get bogged out or bogged down, but they soon find out that those tactics really work. That's creepy as hell, by the way, how that creature moves and snarls. Oh, delayed action, massive shot. That's bad. I don't know if I'm going to be able to interrupt that. I can, just, I can interrupt that one, though. All right, imbued blade, lightning strike, deals five da deals dash five tiles, deal up to three hundred ninety damage. One, two, three. Yeah, I don't think so. Let's do it on this one. Shred them down. Yes. Yes, of course. Of course I will shred. Um, I'll slash this one too. A clean cut. Now that's going to make her initiative go all the way down to 100 over behind me here. Instead of 50. After your turn, you normally go back to 50 over there. But since I used more action points than... Uh, I left myself with less than 50 action points... That means the initiative order for her goes all the way over there. Yeah. All right. End the turn for Clements. Boo. Boo can go for the eyes. Go for the eyes, Boo. Oh, I can't shield bash this with the other one. Balls. One less to plague the innocent. What did that witch unlock? We got another witch the veil guardian. Grows weaker. His power is stronger. Oh, what? You can't spawn people behind me? What's wrong with you? They collect pieces of broken souls. How do they do that? This game looks cooler than you thought it would be, Nolan. Yeah, it's pretty groovy. Very stark, uh, bleak art style, for sure. It definitely gets uh, some attention for that, right? Should I shoot this guy? This guy's gonna absolutely wreck me when he goes. I don't think there's anything I can do about it. How dare you wound a scavenger? Is it worth taking the extra shot? I will stay. That was very close to killing her. They collect pieces of broken souls. That was really bad. 
Just wondering, did you wear black and red today just for this game? You know what is really funny that you said that? I actually put this shirt on specifically because I knew I was going to play a game that was mostly black, white, and red. I did put this shirt on. <laughs> How funny is that? You can take two shots without delaying a turn. It's 25 AP a shot. Oh, okay. So I was just dumb there. Uh, big decision though. Is this a PC buy or a play in bed on Switch buy? I don't play anything on in bed on the Switch. That's that's more of a personal decision, Nolan. That's up to you. I don't know. Hashtag game. You can look at it on Humble. Uh, you could probably get it cheaper if you have Humble Choice. Sometimes uh, they have Switch games on Humble, too. I didn't put the link in for that, but if if it's on Switch through Humble, you can get it on there, too. They do do Switch games. Um, I don't, I don't know if I have a way to heal. All right, let's shoot this one. I revel in her strength. Memories of another life. Guard them well. Um. Let's get her the hell out of there. I don't know how to heal. So if you use AP to go burst, you might as well use all of it, right? I think so. The uh, Actually, the remaining stuff you have, like I had 14 AP remaining, so she went to an 86 initiative. So, no. Maybe it's okay to leave some left over. Instead of going to 100, you go to 86. I don't know. Maybe that'll come into an effect at, at some point. How foolish my fears. Okay, um The veil grows. Now weak. I see why you want to have some of those this health percentage abilities. So you can kinda of like cue them up now and not actually take any of your uh your action points. Alright, now Let me go over here. Lunge. 212 up to three times. Oh, that should do it. That was pretty good. Striking. And let's end the turn there. Three enemies remain. Don't kill her! He's going for my wounded one. You just summon people, like, right behind you. That makes it very hard. Oh, no. This is dicey. as well whatever we can to prevent this torture okay I don't know how I'm gonna get over there in time I don't think I'm gonna Can move again, but I'm not 
I don't think I'm gonna be able to shield bash anybody. Can I stand in front of it? Maybe? Intercepting around, interrupt the first attack uh, ally. Hmm. I wonder if I stand over here, does that put me in cover? Do they have cover in this game? Can I stand behind like this crystal shard thing? All right, let me shoot first. We just kill it. I don't have to hide then. I just kill it. Here we go. Striking. That's better. Oh wow. So the soul slinger is really good. Progress has its setbacks. Yes. Okay. Victory. Come, Come what may, may, we will, we will slow, slow suffering's, suffering's progress. progress. You say progress, I say progress. Let's call the whole thing off. Though the danger passes, we must prepare for the next. To heal a daughter's wounds, you have to sacrifice another one. What? Enter the sacrifice chamber. What? The sacrifice chamber? That sounds unfun. Where's the sacrifice? Oh, sacrifice down there. You had noticed they don't heal after battle? Was wondering about that? Oh, that is dicey. Hmm. Okay. So prudence is really bloody. Oh, you can actually you can see the blood amount. Look how bloody. It's making you choose your favorite child. Messed up. <laughs> um. Okay. They have names? Yeah, look over here. Boo, Clements, Prudence. I only got the name Boo so far. Alright, so if I re... What does regenerate do? The only way to heal a daughter is to sacrifice another daughter of an equal or higher level. The surviving daughter will be healed and receive a fragment of the sacrificed daughter's soul, gaining some of its power. The sacrificed daughter will be laid to rest in the cemetery. Okay, we're not we're not sacrificing Boo. We're going to sacrifice Clements. To heal Boo. No, to heal Prudence. Yes. So I, I kind of like the gun one. Why are you biting your tongue, Adverse? Adverse, go ahead, spit it out. Adverse can't sit on their hands. Bad choice. Alright, why? What's going on? The, the game told me to do it. <laughs> the game told me to sacrifice to heal. <laughs> Just make another daughter and then sacrifice it. Okay, because that won't be level two then. Okay. You also tend to blame the game. They literally just told me to do that, right? Okay, there we go. Make a new daughter. Give life to our daughters. Okay. Please, guide her well. <laughs> She's literally just about to die. All right. We'll just name her Mer- we'll just keep it Mercy. There you go. You were the best soul slinger ever. 
Now, unleash her on any who stand in her way. Okay, I will. I promise. As soon as we go... Regenerate it. Okay. Sacrifice mercy... To regenerate prudence. Oop. Okay. There we go. Oh, it's not the same level, though. Adverse. Adverse. <laughs> I can't do that, then. <laughs> Mercy, Mercy gets to sit there and be fine. Um... What are you doing? I'm listening to Adverse. All right. I'm going back to what I was going to do. I'm going to regenerate. That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over. I'm going to regenerate. Um... Wait, can I do it? Now it seems like it might be letting me. No, the only way to heal the sign. Okay, no, equal or higher level. Okay, I can't do it. Okay. Goodbye. Her sacrifice births another hope. Unnecessary sacrifice achievement unlocked. Alright, sweet. That's kind of rude though, isn't it? No! No, I don't want to do anything else. Okay. And I made Mercy. I can't change the name now. We're just failing all over the place. Now let's look at the cemetery. Remember their courage. Remember the courage of Clemens. You can lit. Wait, wait, wait. You want to see how cold this game can get? Look at this. Remember their courage. You can resurrect Clemens. All right. Or forget them. <laughs> forget. I don't want to even see their name anymore. <laughs> That's so funny. Yeah. You guess Twitch chat reply system is being rolled out slowly through streams? Yeah, it's, it's active on a couple of streams. Um, yeah. Let's see. Well, that's the side of the game, I guess so. Alright, um... I guess we want to go to the next... Available memories. I can increase her a lunge attack. Increase the critical chance of a skill. Her shot. Increase the damage of a skill. Let's do that. Go with this. Next day. A new challenge beckons. You imagine your cemetery would get crowded? I assume so. We have two synapses now. They look pretty much the same. Hey, Rabbit, what's up? All right, we're gonna have two uh, two shooter McGaverns this time. Farewell, daughters. Do you have a limited amount of days to finish campaigns, or is it just a refresh mechanic? I don't know. I don't know. 
I'm still trying to get Here, used to it. Here the legions invaded and dragged this city into purgatory. There's also a really interesting option in the um, options. Uh, I don't know what this means, what faster gameplay means. I don't know what that means. How do you make turn base faster? Yeah. Hey, Rabbit, what's up? Hunt all the creatures, nine of them remaining. Jesus, what is that thing? I hope these are just decorations. Are those decorations? I hope so. All right, well, we got these wigglers over here. As well. I can't stop progress. The cure will be found. Okay. Yeah, this is a tutorial, Rabbit. Yep. We played through it, pretty much. I mean, we're still learning, but... Uh, it's all... A it is AP-based, yeah. See AP here? How many action points you have? Movement plus your abilities cost AP. Um, alright. And then the Shield Bearer. It's gonna get 17 AP. No, that's gonna be 50. That's gonna be the whole turn, pretty much. Let's do it. Do the whole turn. We'll get right in their face. End the turn. Why did I do that? I don't know. I put myself in range of both of them. Okay. Uh, lunge? Are you kidding me right now? You left it with 29 health. 29. Prudence goes next. So I'm just gonna go all in and get this guy. Wow, okay. Both of them. 17, that one. Perfect. Perfect. Come on, Prudence. One less to plague the innocent. 1% wipe. Oh, God. I haven't heard that term in a long time. The 1% wipe. Terror to so Prudence. bad. All right, there's five enemies being Exquisite. remaining. Ten percent health. It's tough to pick uh, an ability that takes health away in a game where you can't regenerate your health. You had a point six five percent wipe the other day. It was fun. Oh, that's so bad. Um. Yeah, I guess I'll just end my turn. They collect pieces of broken souls. Here they come. They walking down the street. Broken souls. All right. They they definitely nailed the creepiness aspect.
Wrathful Rain, deal up to 349 AoE damage, then move to an empty tile. Ah, uh, so that's if they're all around me. I think it's better just to shoot them. And I'm not gonna throw away my shot. Oh, I do he dodged a little bit of that. That wasn't great. Progress has its setbacks. Stop dodging! See, if he didn't dodge... I would've gotten the kill and not have to use my... How foolish extra my action fears. points. Okay. Okay. Oh, I was so scared there. I'm like, really? It got to attack and only did five damage, though? Five damage? Two more enemies. I don't know where they are, though. Oh, they're going to be over here. Come on over. What are these things called? Plague Butchers. Six AP. Deal 282 damage in one push. Push target enemies plowed into each other. Well, I guess I gotta move again. One less to plague the innocent. Alright, let's see if my two uh, shooters can take this guy out before he does any, any other damage. Shot? No. Nope. Too far away. This game seems pretty cool, really, Tegas. You like it? Yeah. having games like this um, to play along with action games and things that take a lot of coordination and stuff so you get super frustrated at a game of Fall Guys or Fortnite or whatever you're playing and you're just like alright time to time to grab a, a glass of wine and tilt my, my seat back have one hand up on the key on the mouse and just be like alright here we go you know not that this game can't be intense cerebrally, but... You were considering buying this, but Monster Train said I can't. I've escaped Monster Train for now. It, it, it'll start right back up. It's the second I lo launch the game and play another round. But for now, I've, uh, I've been playing Fall Guys in Fortnite at night. So that's kind of cured me a little bit. Whatever we can to prevent this torture. 